We've all heard that ringtone, or maybe this one. Because it's either on our phone or someone's phone around us. So you can buy ringtones from Apple, but they cost about a buck thirty. And I don't know about you, but I don't want to spend a dollar thirty on thirty seconds of a song. Ringtones number one can give your ring some originality. It's a free app, but you have to put up with a lot of ads or pay five dollars a month. So I just put up with the ads. You choose from songs in your music library. The app will let you clip 10 seconds from one of them to create your ringtone. Here's how it works. I pick a song, maybe this one from The Stones. Find the clip I want to use. Uh, once that's done, I save the tone. Now, to add it to my phone's library, it gets a little difficult. You'll connect the phone to your computer, find it in iTunes, give the app permission to share files, save the tones to my computer, and import them back into iTunes. Now, the app has directions on how to do this. Now you can select it to ring anytime anyone calls. You can also set different tones for different people. When my daughter calls, I hear this. And when work calls, I hear this. You can also create a ringtone by recording a sound or your voice. Ring. Ring. You can get carried away. Pretty soon you will want a different ringtone for everyone in your favorites list. I'm Jamie Tucker, and ringtones number one is the app of the day.